Sharpening inside a Lightroom is okay, but sharpening inside a Photoshop is amazing. Let me show you the difference in today's Friday Quickie. First, we're going to head up to Photo, Edit In, take this into Photoshop. Once we get into Photoshop, we're going to head up to Layer, Duplicate Layer, and then we're just going to hit OK. From here, we're going to go to Filter, Convert for Smart Filters, you're going to hit OK. Then we're going to go to Filter, Other, High Pass. From here, we can add any amount that we like. I'm just going to add something around three and hit OK. And then next, I need to change the blending mode of this layer. So we're going to head in, choose Soft Light. If you want something a little bit more aggressive, choose Overlay. I'm going to zoom in for a quick before and after. And you can see that sharpening is much, much stronger. Once we have it the way we like, we'll head up to File and Save. And then lastly, we can go to File and hit Close. We'll head over to Lightroom and you'll notice we've got the before sharpening and after sharpening. And that's it. That's sharpening inside of Photoshop. It's much, much better than Lightroom. Hopefully you enjoyed this tip. Have a great weekend, everybody.